My name is Mukdo Asha Kumar. I am in seventh grade. Today, we are going to do a science experiment. What we're going to do is extract DNA out of a strawberry. If you're going to do this experiment, you have to make sure you're supervised by an adult. We are going to need the following ingredients for this experiment. So let's get started. You will need some table salt, dishwashing liquid, water, a filter, a measuring cup, a graduated cylinder or test tube, a wooden skewer, some measuring supplies and teaspoons or tablespoons, some spoons, coffee filter, strawberries, a Ziploc baggie and rubbing alcohol. We need this. We need you to freeze this rubbing alcohol as we need it later. If you haven't already frozen this rubbing alcohol, please do so. All right, let's get started. To start this experiment, you will need a half teaspoon of salt. water, and one tablespoon of dishwashing liquid. Then you're just going to have to mix it. You can pour in more if you like. More water, more dishwashing liquid if you like. Sorry, Junior. Once you've decided how much you're going to put, just go ahead and mix it around for 30 seconds. If you see that it's then like this, you're done. Now, let's go ahead and crush a strawberry. So you'll need a Ziploc baggie. Open it up, and you're just going to put in one strawberry. Make sure all air is out of the bag, then let's seal it. Then, let's go ahead and crush it. Nice and slow for one minute. Then, let's go ahead and add three tablespoons of this liquid and put it into the bag. Let's soak it in the bag. Let's go ahead and mix, crush it again for a nice warm minute. So this is how it should look like when you mix strawberry with an extraction liquid. But now you don't need this extraction liquid anymore. Let's set this for a sign for now.
Now, you'll want to get your measuring cup and one coffee filter. You'll want to make sure it's secured in place. So cover it up like this. And then we're going to pour this into here. So we're going to pour the strawberry mixture from this bag into the, this funnel. If it doesn't work, you can just pull it off. And we're just going to poke it around for a while. Just to get some of that texture. Alright, now that we're done, let's go ahead and pour out the rubbing alcohol. Make sure, now that we're working with rubbing alcohol, go ahead and get your rubbing alcohol out of the freezer. I'll go ahead and wait. Alright, so I'm assuming that you've already done it. Now, let's carefully open up this rubbing alcohol. And we're just going to pour some of this alcohol into the funnel. It should take a while, though, because then rubbing alcohol is mixing with the strawberry extraction. As you mix it around more, you, can, you should see some liquid pouring from the bottom. This is where your strawberry DNA comes from. We're mixing rubbing alcohol with strawberry mixed with an extraction liquid. It's okay if, if, if it doesn't come out that much. You should be able to see it though. Just poke it around a bit with your wooden skewer, but don't poke a hole through it. If you see some of this new liquid come out, that means you have done this experiment correctly. And yes, once you're done with this experiment, please dump out everything and no tasting. This is dangerous because we're working with rubbing alcohol. Alright, you have officially done this experiment. You can also do this experiment with other fruits like blueberries, raspberries, blackberries. Any fruit. Thank you all for watching this watching this video and doing this experiment. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel, share this video, and like it.